welcome back everybody we are at um, soul 127 here at uh, surviving mars and um, uh, yeah we are um, i think we're gonna start getting fairly busy quite soon um uh, we've we've got some stuff oh and there goes the gold wave beautiful let's turn off the subsurface heater we don't need you your services for the for the time being um let's see meteor storm is still coming down where in that corner okay so can we i think i'll leave these resources for the time being let's let's gather everything that's a little bit further away from us first and research wise okay yeah so three hours left let's take our explorer as well well maybe just not just yet well just one hour left by the time he gets there should be gone and um and yeah let's boost our research a little bit once we get the moisture vaporators we should be yeah then we'll start building building a couple as well and we'll get the infrastructure built so we are ready to welcome our first few um colonists okay so Sector let's see scanned. again nothing Well, that's not very nice, is it? Let's see. So, not much in here. Let's just clear it out. So it's nice and nice and beautiful. Okay. What was I gonna do? Almost, almost forgot. Um. Oh yeah, to remember now. Thinking of sending, sending him out again. Capture the meteors. Yeah, let's do it again. Just really need that uh, those anomalies. Wow, there are just a ton of resources here. Let's see. 20, 60, 154 metals, 7 polymers, 189 metals and 17 polymers there. Wow, it's just loaded. Yeah. It's quite a bit down here as well, actually. Scroll out again and let's see. Yeah, loads of metals. I don't... I actually think that we might not need the... We don't need to rush the metal... Anomaly e analyzed. Extract is only a thousand, but hey, it's better than... Better than 900, for example. That's good. Gives us a bit of a boost. We're at 54% now into the vaporators, so so getting there. I reckon, let's see, how much did we need for moisture vaporators? We needed, so it takes 7,000, we're halfway there, so we're sitting at about, what is it, 3,700, 800 for 55%. 700 per soul, so if we are... So maybe like another four souls. Uh, yeah, we should get it researched in this episode. And hopefully the next uh, set of meteors that will come down, uh, hopefully they're gonna bring even more anomalies for us to research. Let's see, he's done already. Do we still have space for metals? We do. Ooh, that looks beautiful. That's a lot of lot of stuff there. Okay. What else can we do? Hmm. Yeah, I really want to produce. Uh, Stop producing electronics to get them to 100 so we could get another 300 research points. Ah, uh, that would be so sweet. Let's see. 
sides. Okay. All right. Yeah, so once we get those, we can put them, put the moisture vapor this down. Oh, I cannot wait. Cannot. Um. Okay, I think you might have to be careful over here. Okay, let's see what happens. Must say, I think I'm a little bit worried. Yeah. And that was justified. Just look where they're going. They're coming straight in there. And now he's chasing... Oh no, he's coming back. Now he's coming down. Uh, yeah, now he's definitely chasing us. Oh well. Uh, let's just... Uh, get away from there then. Let's take all this stuff first. Beautiful. Okay. Not a problem at all. Sector scanned. Another sector done. Again, nothing. Ah, oh, that is disappointing. Very disappointing. Oh well. Let's see. 93 concrete over here so that is that is looking good the quicker we get it done the better right another thing I noticed uh, in the last or two episodes ago was that um, something in our base used up one of our electronics and yes it is just one but it was still a little bit annoying since we, we do have the scrubbers here, so technically they shouldn't need any any maintenance. But somehow they... Well, one of these guys used up one of the electronics. Wasn't ideal. Should we build... Yeah, we got metals. Well, once it's done... We're not gonna need... We're gonna gain back this 15 power from here. So that is... That is good. Uh, hello there. You going... You going that way? Oh, that's good. That's good to hear. Let's see. The rocket's almost there. And these devils are gone. I do wanna tap into... Let's see. Over here. And now we bring you back. I think I have time to do one, this one run, maybe. How many hours? 18 hours. Okay, we should have time to uh, to do um, at least one supply run. You are at base, and you should be at base as well. I think I'm gonna. Yeah, we're gonna probably probably salvage him. Uh, at least we'll get five polymers. It's not a lot of resources for for what it uh, what it costs to cost to build, but uh, I mean, oh well, we'll just have to deal with it. All right, seventy six percent on the. 77% uh, on the on the research now. We're very close. And 66 concrete left. Okay. Uh, maybe let's uh, let's have a look over here then. What can we build inside? So I think we're gonna have to build two residences for them. One of these will be blocked for services. One will be blocked for food, food production. I think one should sustain our colony. If we need more, then... Um, I think we'll probably put some farms outside. Could be an option. The, the um, fungal farm. 
That's the one I'm talking about. We still have to research it and stuff, but uh, that is okay. Okay, so the meteors will... Wait, let's pause it. It has already started. Where? Um... Oh, down there. Okay. Okay, that's good. Hopefully, no, they're going up. Well, Dust go storm approaching. Okay, thank you, good lady. Hopefully, it goes directly up and not towards northeast. Oh, we'll see. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Nice. A breakthrough. Ooh. Okay, let's bring you down. Uh, where is our RC Explorer? Can you go there, please? Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Those meteors are... Uh, you know what? Hmm. I really do want to send him out there, though. Well, let's... Let's follow him. It's a little bit risky, but uh But I think we are We're feeling greedy. Let's go this way. Come straight over here. Let's see what kind of breakthrough can we get. If only this was the extractor AI, oh my god, I would be so happy. So... Uh. But let's not get excited before we scan it. I think the chances are... Yeah, I'm not feeling overly optimistic about it, that we find it. Or maybe it's going to be one of those things that, um, you know, it will be like the very last breakthrough we'll get. And by that time, we're already at a stage uh, with our colony where we we, we, we no, no longer need it. It's like it's one of those um, technologies that you would be very useful sort of early to mid game. But mid to late game, it's kind of like, well, you've already got so many people. So it's more like, ah, uh, meh. Almost there. Right, so it seems the meteors didn't actually go up. They're just sitting around this area over here now. Hmm. Interesting. Well, a couple of them to spread out a little bit, but... Let's see. Dust storm in one soul. Meteor storm is almost done. You know what we'll do? We'll send out another... Can we? We can. Just go. And you? Almost done. Oh, there's another... Breakthrough discovered. Oh, no. It's not the one we wanted. I knew it. Oh, new planetary anomalies. Another four. Should we check it out now? Probably should. RC Commander will give us research progress. Beautiful. What else? That gives us research progress as well. If you send some drones, absolutely we would do that. We don't have Safari. Officer for technologies. I, we, we don't have any of those either. I think that's 10 coins for breakthrough. Another breakthrough. Honest. Yeah, I think that's that's all of them then. Okay, well wait, where are you? Over here. So we gained access to Martian Born Ingenuity, which gives them ten performance. Mm. Oh it's a beautiful uh, breakthrough. I'm not gonna say it's bad or anything. It's uh, it's just a 
not quite uh, so useful for us right now. Okay, we'll try and uh, dodge them all. Okay, now let's go up. Ooh, okay. Hello. And dust devils here as well. I think we'll make it. I hope, at least. Okay, so the rocket's off. We're gonna call in some more meteors. Research complete. Moisture farming, yes. That is beautiful. Ugh. Okay. Uh, let us see. Do we want to add anything? I think the next one after the few eternal fusion breakthrough. Do we go into nuclear fusion or should we focus on getting nine of those now? Uh, if I remember correctly, we had four of them were done. That would be number five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And to be honest, our money, well, the money we would gain from this would be much more useful right now rather, rather than later. Hmm. How badly do we need more power? Just thinking with all the things we... Our power producers, will we be... I mean, here, these only produce five. I have one wind turbine that produces like a little bit more. I just can't remember how much domes consume. Hmm. Well, we've got a little bit more time to figure that out. Yeah. Okay. Right, so let's start um, placing down. Sector or, scanned. At least figuring out where they should go. So, with the moisture vaporators, I've done this mistake before, so I'm not going to do it again. Um, the sort of sphere that, um, that is around the, the moisture vaporator in, in blue, the highlighted section. Uh, we can't place another vaporator inside that area or we're going to lose performance. So, I mean, technically, yes, you can you can place it there if you want it. But it's going to um, suffer a performance loss. Oh, this one's depleted. That is beautiful. Okay, let's place this down like so. And now since, well, you're not needed anymore. Let's destroy you. All that concrete is done now. Ooh. A dust storm. Let's see, can we... Collect all this. And bring it back to base. Okay, so back to um, planning out our colony's infrastructure. Now, how much does it produce? Uh, base production is one. Wait. Base production is one? I can't check how much they were producing. So I have how many? We've got two over here, don't we? Two moisture vapora vaporators. 
So I'm thinking... Let's see. Okay, let's um, pick another one. Well, first of all, what does it take to build it? Right, so two metals, five polymers, and it's going to need five power and uses metals for maintenance. Which won't matter since we are going to have the scrubbers here. Okay, so... We could place... Where could we place the other one? So I want to have pipes run from the middle. Which means... Do we need to leave like a little gap here so that... All those things can... People and drones can go inside? Not sure. But um... It's the range. I want everything to be within the this range here as well. Okay, so let's see. I don't think we can place it like so. But we will be able to do it this way. Okay. Okay, we should be able to build or or all this. Oh, another thing we'll we'll then have to place down is we'll need some temporary power solution. The easiest one will be to do solar panels because wind turbines. Well, I mean, we could build maybe maybe just a couple, but I just don't don't want to use the machine parts just yet, and then. Yeah, it's much easier to do it with... Um, Resources are low. With that, is it? A little bit. Yeah, we'll have one of these guys. Here, maybe some solar panels around it as well. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. About time. What to be find? Oh, another... One of these guys. Hmm. Go scan it. Okay. So let's see. Um, should we start building this now? We'll have a meteor. Actually, no. Let's see where this meteor storm is going to go. Once we do see it, then we can decide where to... Uh, what we can to however is to filter out some of those colonists over here now we are probably going to prefer youth and adults we don't want any kids we don't want any seniors just for the pure reason that they do not help us in any way they don't work so i'm sorry but you're kind of useless um uh, let's see Mm -hmm. Let's go back. Any perks? Uh, there are no celebrities. Right. We are going to prefer sexy people. Oh, there's a saint in here as well. Let's see. And quite a few religious ones. So, um, religious people have a higher base morale and... Uh, Low sanity never leads to suicide, so that is that is very good. Workaholics are nice as well. Their performance is increased. What else should we should we get? I think these are kind of like the like the main ones we want to aim for. There's, there are no geniuses. That is unfortunate. I've Fit, um, enthusiast. Yeah, those are all nice, but... Well, let's have a look. Flaws. Okay, we don't want any cowards. Because they double the sanity loss from disasters and... 
with the settings we have this and um, disasters all the all the time uh chronic condition loses health each day mm. i mean i suppose you know having infirmary will mitigate some of that but uh prefer not to we don't want any idiots because they can break stuff um lazies are also not what we uh, want to bring to our colony and whiners mm, i don't i don't actually know if um this will be an issue i think it might be but maybe not anyways let's uh uh works okay some vegans and stuff okay cool so what do we have here we have a religious and sexy person uh nice we have a venus who is religious sexy and rugged beautiful oh no saniva is tourist uh specialization okay we do need to filter tourists out i'm afraid okay let's have a look again so angskar from sweden yep ragnar nilsson sexy workaholic party animal um let's see increased performance penalty melancholic and gambler mm. not the let's lock some people in um we want you for sure we want ragna we want venus ashlyn Belinda, hmm, maybe we can find something better. We'll see. Ah, oh, he's a gambler as well. Damn it. Ah, uh, religious, nerd, and workaholic. Okay. I suppose you're okay. Tyra, religious, okay. Hippie and religious. Anar, loner. Suppose we're not going to have more than 30 at the start. And by the time we get over 30, you might already be dead. Uh, what do we have here? I swear to God, most of those people are from Sweden. Anyways, Ida is a gambler, survivor and workaholic. Suppose we could take it. Yeah, one, two, three. No, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight people are from Sweden. Wow. Okay. Anyways, let's uh, let's check this out as well. <clears throat> uh, Lick over here isn't too bad. And same with um, Antoinette. Freya is a loner but that's okay is it just me but it seems i've got way more females than males hmm actually yeah, let's check that how many males do we have we have one two three three males so we need to okay we are gonna need to find some males then she's a female no okay so we have enthusiast religious and a nerd male adult um okay we are gonna lock you in male you enthusiast and workaholic and alcoholic which um, isn't great because, um, yeah. Let's see. Let me find Owen. What are you? Party animal. Sexy, melancholic. Uh, okay, we could do Goodmunds. 
and sticker religious vegan and gamer oh what is this he's she sorry is a saint vegan and gamer and uh, raises moral of all religious people in the dome so that she might actually be very good because we have a lot of religious people duncan okay so we have 19 selected already i'm sure we can uh, filter this out we need to drop seven uh, seven colonists um, and then we are good let's see oh, it's got two negative ones if she had only one we could take her but no sorry Belinda Tindra now we got loads of females that have very nice um, perks so let's see what else so you are a saint so we'll keep you steger okay he's he's male so that's okay let's count one male two male and also religious that is good religious third male he's good as well freya loner ah oh, she's all right antoinette Hippie sexy survivor. Yeah, we're definitely gonna keep her. I do I think uh, now that we have a saint, I would prefer to keep the ones that are religious. Aner, so he's number four, fourth male. Dindra Tyra Kutmund fifth male Gail. Oh, this is going to be very, very tough to filter this this out. Okay, we do have six males, so that is good. So we need to filter out um some uh, some females then. Okay, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna go through this real quick, and I'll be back to to show you once uh, once I have filtered it out. All right, and here we go. I've finally managed to. Um, really go through everyone in this list, and I had to remove. Uh, yeah, it was it, it was very tough. It was very tough to choose, but I essentially had to kick out some uh, some some females that were. Uh, I had only one trait, and that was religious. Most of the other females um, now, I think everyone has either sexy or or religious or or both, just like with. Uh, who was it? Venus here, I think. Yeah, religious and sexy. Everyone else is um, is good. And the only reason I'm bringing um, Adelheid over here is is because um, she is a saint and she's gonna raise the morale of uh, of everyone that's religious. But okay, uh, with uh, that being sorted, um, we are gonna call it the episode here, and and in the next one. I'm hoping we'll have the infrastructure built for the first colonist and then we can fly this uh, fly this rocket back as well. I do hope they are not going to disappear. Let's let's have a look. Back passengers. Yes, they are going to stay here. So that is good. Um so thank you very much for joining in this episode and I really hope to see you again Research in the complete in the next one. All right, take it easy everyone.